My name is Marcus Lowry, and I'm a portrait artist from Asheboro, North Carolina. The style of art that I do is portrait realism, and I chose this art because I'm able to create a photo that was never taken and make it into real life. I actually had multiple people here in Asheboro um, give me a lot of support and everything when I started posting on social media on Facebook. And my uncle, he was incarcerated and he, he was actually an artist and he would send me all his drawings and letters on the back of um, like a piece of paper he would draw like cartoon characters and I would come home every day after school and just start tracing over it like almost every day tracing over it and practice the shading. When I first realized that I could do this was when I actually seen that multiple like like I said celebrities and like Cindy Farmer when they actually seen my artwork that showed me that I can actually really do this and have this as a career for myself. And I had um, different artists from around Randolph County see it. And one of my art teachers from school actually see my artwork and they, they told me that I'm actually better than them now. That actually motivated me a lot more to be like what God has actually called me to be. And what makes my work different is I can like I said, I can create a photo that was never taken and actually make it into something like special for someone. Like I can say, say if a grandma never met a grandchild, I can put that grandma in the photo holding the grandchild and things like that. That's what makes it different. Um, yeah, I try and connect as much as I can and show my customers that I care about like what's really going on and what's the meaning behind the yeah. art. Um, the way that they can actually meet with me to exchange like the art piece, like we can meet up um, and discuss discuss the uh, what they really want, and that way I can actually get a visual of what they actually want to do and everything like that. Yeah, that that's that's one good thing about what I do is because I'm able to bring peace into somebody's life. I'm able to bring joy and happiness into somebody's life, or like. I can bring that into their home. They, they can say if they were stressing over that one moment like they never was able to take a picture, they can actually have that moment captured and put up in their home. That's one good thing about it. One thing that I could say that I would want my generation and the younger generation is that if you actually have faith and believe that things can happen in your life and follow your dreams and just make sure, like, like I said, have faith, then they'll come true. Like if you just keep on praying about it and just um, rely on God, it'll come true. And one one uh, scripture that stuck with me was, uh, I, I believe it was Habakkuk 2 and 2. It said, write the vision and make it plain. And even though it may tarry, which means take a long time, then for surely it'll come at an appointed time. Mm. So with me believing in that scripture, that's what's really motivating me. That's what's driving me. That's what's really motivating me to keep on going because I know if I have the faith, then I know that this will come true for me one day. And I actually believe in it, then it'll come true. And uh, I, it was another, I don't, I don't know what scripture it was, but I remember it saying, uh, you have not because you ask not. So that's, that's another scripture that really um, was set on my heart because that drove me to pray. That, that drove my faith a lot, a lot more. Because if you, I mean, if you ask for it, then you'll get it. I, I really feel like this is, my artwork's going to take off. Though. Yeah. It, it may take some time, but with everything that's going on and people, different people seeing my artwork, I yeah. really think I'm going to get somewhere with it. I remember I was, I was in an area in my life where I really didn't know what I was going to do after high school. I was getting ready to join the military. I just didn't know. So I remember one day I prayed and I asked God to give me a job or give me some way that I can actually bring joy and like allow people to like smile off of the things that I do for them. And like, it was wow. just right there in front of me. So this is really what I want to do now. When I noticed that I can actually, like I said, just make people smile and it makes people happy to see my artwork. Like this is really what I want to do now. Like, this is just an answer prayer that was sitting in front of me the whole time. So I, 
guess he was just he was just taking um just waiting on me I'm at the point where I really just want to um just like drop everything and just yeah. focus on this really 